What up, y'all? This is your boy Lucha Guy, and I'm back with another video. I want to see this first hit like a monster Lucha slam that like and subscribe button. I notice I'm getting way, way more viewers lately than usual. I'm going to stay on the wrestling topic. I don't want to keep running on AEW. One guy, he did a video and it kind of inspired me to look at the WWE because some people have been saying the WWE is mad hot right now. I know they were interested in Mania season. I didn't know if that was still the case because some people from Raw last Monday was like dry and SmackDown also. Some people's even seen it. Cody Rhodes promos are the same. So I actually want to ask you guys, do you think Cody Rhodes is a good champion so far? No, he hasn't even had one title defense, but some people are already getting bored with him as champion. I guess he's facing AJ Styles at Backlash France or whatever the hell they're calling it. This is to be just Backlash back in the day, not Backlash in the name of the city. Like, what was the next, next year? Backlash Paris, Backlash uh, Tokyo. Like, that was just Backlash. Like, but I give Cody Rhodes a SummerSlam. How long you guys even think he'll be champion to? I mean, I give it to like SummerSlam. Word is it will be the Rock at somewhere. Because the Rock, I guess his schedule will be busy late summer um, into the fall. He ain't going to do whatever the September pay per view is. Not a champion's class of champions. He could. I mean, that'll make that pay per view mean something, but. Because he won't even be there the whole SummerSlam to set it up. Is it going to be some little social media beef setting up SummerSlam? Is it going to be the bloodline for fighting for the Rock to SummerSlam? Like, and then the bloodline, I guess they already got on. What's the guy from New Japan? I forgot his name. Tama Tonga, he's in there. And then, J um, J I should say that for the MLW talk. But um, Jacob Fatu, he's in WWE now. I know he's signed. They might have to go over some things. Because usually they don't go by Fatu. He might be Jacob Uso or some shit. But um, <laughs> we, we'll talk about that when the MLW talk comes. But let me know what y'all think of down below about Cody Rose's champion. And so far in his reign, some people are already getting bored. Like, there's, I don't know what dream match is he even going to have as champion. Him and Randy Orton. Like, it's going to be like 2009 Raw. Um, what was that group again? Legacy. What are they going to do? Cody Rose and Rawlings, this sounds like a like a raw main event. That don't seem like somehow or anybody should pay for it, a POE or whatever they're doing now for pay-per-views or Cody versus uh, Bobby Lashley, Cody versus Miz. Like these matches don't sound exciting. Him and R Truth, I would love to see that though. Him and Danny and Priest, like what dream matches is Cody Rose gonna have on um as champion in the WWE? Next, it's the MLW talk. I, I actually never ever went to a real wrestling show. And I actually want to shot 10 1 this year because this is going to be in my city right here, Chicago, May 11. I don't even know if they're sold out because MLW, another problem, what the hell are they available at? Because available at? I was trying to watch them on YouTube. I see they only upload the big matches like their own um, Battle Riots or not Battle Riot, whatever the hell they did, Battle Riot or their own, um, whatever the last show was. They only upload like their little big shows like a pay-per-view or whatever on the YouTube channel. They're not even on YouTube no more the shows and I don't even know who the hell's there. I know CML, CMLL is just everywhere now on AEW. They're just trying to get the Luchadors noticed. Like, um, what do y'all think, too, with Azteca Lucha? I know they changed the name first. It was Azteca Underground. Now it's Azteca Lucha. They constantly, like, switched the name to it. I don't know. I don't really know. Is this going to be just a big show? Is it even going to lead to something? I know Cesar Duran, Dario Crito, he have a theme for Selena De La Rana where they're going to do their team of Luchadors versus each other. See, or Dario, Cesar Duran, he's going to have a team of Luchadors versus her team of Luchadors. Um... And I don't even know what happens if they win. Does somebody got to merge? Like, I mean, I hope this eventually leads to a real show because we need Lucha Underground back. AEW, as you've seen my last few videos, AEW now was a flop. It sucks. It been sucked, but now the fans can't even deny it. We need some back in the spot that Lucha Underground was at. It don't even have to be, it don't got to be connected to the world Lucha Underground was in. They start all over with Caesar Doran or whatever his name is. You're already connected with Boyle Heights. Like, what the hell? You're already connecting the guy, his character with Boyle Heights. What other business he got back in Boyle Heights besides Lucha Underground? We need something in the spot that Lucha Underground was at. I don't care if I want to call it Azteca Lucha, Lucha Aztecas, whatever the hell. We just need some type of Lucha show with Lucha Doors. It could be CMLL people with a few jobbers from MLW. I don't care for Matt Riddle. I know he's there. I'm just waiting for him to leave. Like I said, Jacob Fatu left. He's now in, um, he signed with WWE. He might have to go by Jacob Uso because the Fatu last name don't exist in WWE. Look at the Usos. J, J, and J, and Jimmy. Is, their last name is Fatu, but they have to call them um, Usos. 
But um, yeah, y'all let me know down below what y'all think about um MLW. Like, where are they even available at? Like, they're ruining their own product. Like, it, nobody's gonna pay for a streaming service just to get MLW. And then, should I go to this event? I mean, I might want to look. I might definitely go over there. I wonder where there still be tickets available because I know MLW they ain't popping like that now. I'm hearing more about TNA currently in the MLW. But if they want to get back buzzing again, MLW do some type of spinoff of Azteca Lucha. I know before some people said they were on a TV deal that never happened. You don't need a TV deal. Just air whatever on a YouTube channel. Launch a separate YouTube channel called Azteca Lucha. Like Caesar Doran on his own YouTube channel. And they can air the Lucha Underground-like product, the show. Give us something. But I'm out. Peace. It's your boy Lucha Guy. And like a monster, Lucha Slim. And like a subscribe button. All right. Peace.